This is KMTV 3 News Now. Hi, I'm Cerise Cole with 3 News Now. Here's a look at what's happening now. New COVID cases are down, but overall hospital numbers are still not at the levels health leaders want to end Omaha's mask mandate. Friday, area, area hospitals reported 88% of their beds were full. The ICU occupancy rate is 89%. The overall number of hospitalized COVID cases is now 317. That includes 53 in the ICU and nine pediatric cases. An area nonprofit plans to say thank you to Omaha today at the site that symbolizes its holiday fundraising push. Salvation Army leaders and staff will gather at 90th and Dodge at 10 o'clock this morning. That's the site of the Tree of Lights. This time they'll rally in front of a giant blue and red gift box. It's in part to say thank you to the community for its record setting donations and to help launch a new national level program called Love Beyond. And on 3 News Now, Chief Meteorologist Mark Stitz. Lots of sunshine to kick off the work week, and we start to warm back up. Highs close to average, around 39 degrees. Overnight, not as cold as a few more clouds start to push in. We'll drop it down to 23. And then tomorrow afternoon, it's going to be windy, but also warm. Highs near 58 degrees with a mix of sun and clouds. Doesn't last long, though. We drop back down to 39 for Wednesday with mostly cloudy skies and some extra wind. And then late Wednesday night heading into Thursday, potential for a little wintry mix and snow, but should stay south of the Omaha Metro, more down towards northwest Missouri. So most of us will be dry midweek. Thursday afternoon, a little bit colder, highs near 30. And then we rapidly warm back up into the weekend. Both Friday and Saturday, mostly sunny with low 50s. And Sunday, we're going to make another run for 60 degrees.